How's it going out there, YouTubers? Stubborn X Shark here with another new unboxing video for you. So let's get right into this unboxing and see what it's about. So yesterday I had the chance of getting some awesome new great Blu-ray films on sale for a really decent price at Target. And I decided to do an unboxing video even though that these films are uh, you know about a month old since they've been released. I thought it'd be interesting to still sh just unbox them and show you what all the good and awesome goodness is in them. So actually I ended up picking up another one yesterday that I absolutely think is an amazing film. The soundtrack is so amazing and the best and just awesome and just I, I was really blown away by how good of a film this was. And this is the film Atomic Blonde. Atomic Blonde is just an amazing awesome film and really made me like Charlie's there on again because I I'm not a big fan of hers I don't think she's as good as she thinks she is I think she's kind of overrated but this film really brought back those old roots of hers like when she did reindeer games prior to when she won her Oscar for monster really and it's just a really well-rounded film and directed so beautifully so you can see here it's an awesome cover it shows Charlie's there on uh, on it you know with her name and James McAvoy it's a focus feature uh, is the you know universal focus features release and uh, just really awesome looking cover I love the blue the dark blue and stuff then on the sides it says a Tom Twan as well along with blu-ray and DVD symbol here and then of course the universal symbol because they're released it same thing on the same side there and then of course in the back it shows the kick-ass scene going on there between Charlie Theron and some bad guys and then of course some pictures over here from the movie as well and then of course talk, tells you about the delete uh the bonus features and stuff like that so let's pull that off and open this bad boy up and see what's inside get messed up trust enough open this bad boy up oh yeah trust and miss enough open that up this requires that voice you never heard it all right once again, a nice case. Not too bad, not too bad. You can see there, it's the same exact front on this cover as well as the slip cover. Same side as well. And same back as well with all the special features and you know awesomeness of the pictures and stuff there from the film. So let's open that up. So of course, you got the awesome digital code. And then also you got, on the other side, you get another free movie from Universal, which they seem to do in every one of their Blu-ray releases now, where you get the extra free film, which is kind of cool. But the only thing that sucks about that is that they don't change them up enough. So, like, if you get, like, five, six movies a time from Universal, you get all those free movies, it's like you'll pretty much buy up all their, their free, you know, HD digitals that they have already. So, you know, that's the only thing that sucks about that. But that's cool. And then, of course, you got your disc, which are, uh, I like it that they're black and not just the plain blue. It says Atomic Blonde, which I think is really nice. Looks definitely better than just that plain blue look like that. Uh, even though they're very plain, still very nice. A lot better than just the plain blue that they usually do, which is not too bad. And, of course, you got your single DVD disc. And then you got your single Blu-ray disc over here. Not a second disc, unlike the Dunkirk one. Uh, which you never know, never you know, never. I, I would have until I had pulled that off. I would have never known there was that special disc in the Dunkirk. But yeah, I thought that was interesting. But yeah, this one's also it's just really nice looking. I really like it. It's nice smooth black color and just really nice. So we got bonus features on this bad boy, and some of these d bonus features are is you got deleted and extended scenes, which is always all fun, especially. When there's like certain scenes you're like, I didn't really understand that. And they have a deleted scene that totally explains that. I love it when they have the deleted scenes or they add them back in the film for like an extended cut. I, I always find the original director's vision so much better than usually the theatrical version. You got Welcome to Berlin, which is probably talking about that era of Berlin and what was going on and stuff like that. Then you got Blondes Have More Gun. Then you got Spy Master, which must be like another, you know, documentary. And then you got Anatomy of a Fight Scene, which is, you know, probably, you know, a little bit about different, a certain fight scene that they do in the film and how it got all put together and stuff like that, which is always fun. You got Story in Motion and with commentary by director David Leach, who David Leach, if you didn't realize, is one of the co-directors of John Wick, uh, the first film. 
uh, who didn't get a credit for it, and he made this movie so good. And then you got also feature commentary with director David Leach and editor Elsbit Rundle Daughter. That's a name. Holy Moses. Run Rundle's Daughter. That must be German or something. That's interesting. Hmm. Very interesting. But yeah, definitely a, a an awesome movie. I absolutely love this film. But yeah, that's got some great special features. That's really awesome. Put the slip back on. Which and I love I love how many of these newer films come with slips. I love the slips. I think the slips are so awesome. They make the movies look so beautiful. Especially when you put them on the wall and stuff. It makes them so like uniform and stuff like that. Love that. But this is such a great movie. I was so glad that they had this on sale too. Because I literally just watched this like a week ago. I was like so thrilled about it. That they had this on sale. And I was like so like yes, yes. So like I had to definitely pick it up. Because we just, me and my girlfriend absolutely loved this film. We thought it was so awesome. And like I said, the soundtrack, check out the soundtrack. The soundtrack to this movie is amazing. And the fight scenes in this were just so well choreographed. Such an amazing film. Uh, very glad I got this in my collection now. And it's definitely worth a watch if you haven't seen it. Definitely check it out, people. It's so good. So amazing. Great film, Atomic Blonde. So that's it for this unboxing video, folks. As always, thank you for watching. Thank you for liking. And also, thank you for subscribing. And if this is your first time here, or if you've been here before and haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss one of these awesome videos I make, or any of my videos I make. As always, keep your eyes out for any older, newer videos you might not have seen mine yet. And as always, check out that awesome link down below about the awesome horror pack. Now, the Horror Pack is an awesome subscription service that comes right to your door of either four Blu-rays or four DVDs of horror films. Now, if you're a huge horror fan, what wouldn't you like more than awesome limited editions that you can only get through this exclusive pack? So, what are you waiting for? Check it out, people. It's totally worth it. And as always, if you're interested, let me know down in the comments so I can hook you up with a discount on your first month. That's right. Discount, people. As always, catch you the next one.